So, ja. Amazon Tricks von Ivy. Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. It's your girl Princess Renny here and I hope you're doing well. On this channel, we talk about Christian faith, lifestyle, as well as natural hair. This is a lifestyle video because in case you don't know, and also if you're lucky enough to have if you're lucky enough to not have this struggle, yeah. Amazon takes all my money. Let me cl stop clapping. Amazon takes all my money. I'm always ordering stuff and I'm gonna do a quick unboxing with you guys. I have some stuff that I ordered, but then I also have some stuff that I got from um, influencer box boxes um, or like influencer PR boxes that I'm gonna go ahead and share with you guys right now. So let's go ahead and unbox with me. So let's get into these boxes, okay? Oh, as many of you guys already know, I am graduating in two days. Yes, I am. So I also decided to buy this graduation um, stole. It is the same, basically the same one I got for my graduation from college in 2018. But um, now I decided to get another one uh, that's more, uh, it actually says the year 2022. It also says something else on it. Oh, this is nice. Look at him. So I have my graduation stole. On one side, it says black girl magic. And on the other side, it says class of 2022. And let's get into this. This is how you know it's authentic. It's actually hand woven. And it has like real kente cloth, okay? I'm excited to wear this on Tuesday, y'all. I'm graduating, I'm graduating, I'm, I'm, I'm. Okay, this as well, but I am getting it, um, or what is it called? Cashback on this. I wanted to try it out. So I do ride my bike in the summertime and especially in the springtime when the weather's really nice. I go out, I ride my bike and I just go by the water and just like, you know, take it all in. Um, it is really therapeutic for me, so I love doing that. Um, I think I'm opening this wrong. I sure am. This is, it's, it's a bike seat. Simply put, it's dual shock absorbing balls. It's ventilated design for cooling, high density memory foam, and all that stuff. So I don't know how to take off and put on my bike seat, but um, maybe when I go outside, I'm gonna record a video to show y'all what happens. So it has a manual, which, duh, you're gonna need it. You're gonna need to know what you're doing. The tools, how cute is this little box? So make sure you don't lose anything. It just has the box for the tools. Of course, we have the seat. This seat is much bigger than the seat I have. It seems much heavier too. Um, it looks like you just slide it in, but maybe it's not that simple because you gotta make sure it's secure. But um, good luck to me in these nails. Oh, they feel really nice. All right, same brand, different lifestyle, I guess. Um, it is a mouse pad. It's a gaming mouse pad. So it has nine solid color modes. It's non-slip bottom, five dynamic color changing modes. To be honest, this gaming mouse pad, to be honest, it seems really cool, but I just might end up giving it to my brother. I don't know, I feel like this is more his thing. Um, but he probably has one already. So we'll just have to see. We'll see how I feel. Um, but I'm gonna, I'm gonna open it. I don't have a mouse pad or anything. And sometimes when I'm using my mouse, it's so frustrating because it doesn't work all the time. Like it doesn't work as seamlessly as it should. That's what I should say. And it could be because I don't have a mouse pad. Um, but this is what it looks like. Oh, that's cool. So this is, I guess, the stuff that you press 
in order to change the different colors. You can plug it in over here. See that? Okay. This is very, very big. It goes from my head all the way up to my waist. I'm five, three and a half, and everything's proportioned on me. So, um, this is way too big. I don't like it. <laughs> I don't like it, but we'll see. I really feel like this is supposed to be for me to rest my wrists. Especially when I'm editing videos, I might just keep this and give away the pad. By the way, the brand is called Everlasting Comfort, and that's the bike seat and the gaming um, mouse pad. Okay, I opened these already, already did it, but I, um, we had a paint party, and we bought these like goodie bags to put like candy and snacks and juices and all that stuff in, and it came with these really cool stickers that we added to it. So it's been used already. I just didn't get a chance to record the video. This brand is called Zoo Nutrition. I actually haven't opened it yet, but they're supposed to be sending me um, some nutritious <laughs> protein powder. Because y'all know I'm getting in, getting it all in. So they sent me, what is this? They sent me the Optimal Observe Absorption vegan protein. Um, this plant complete. So this one is a vanilla flavor. Vanilla, vanilla. Okay. I want to know how many. Do uh, you use two scoops? It's best taste, smooth texture, no sugar, vegan. Great, tastes great in water. Apparently, I'm gonna try it. I'm gonna see. Uh, shakes, smoothies, recipes. Um. If I do two scoops, I get 42 grams of protein. Yo, hold on. He has 21 grams of protein for two scoops. And this, does this even have protein in it? Nine grams of protein for one scoop. Yum. I'm getting the double amount of protein in that alone. That's lit, okay. So this one is the vanilla. And then please don't tell me it's chocolate, please don't tell me it's chocolate, please don't tell me it's chocolate. And well, I have another one and this one is chocolate. I'm probably gonna do the chocolate in water and see if it turns into like a, I don't even know, we'll see. We will see. What on earth? I'm getting 42 grams of protein. I'm just in awe right now, like, yo. I a PDCAAS of one, which is the best, di best, best digestibility score, so it goes down easy. That's cool. Then last but not least, I have a package from Morphe, which is part of the influencer, um, influencer <laughs> box box. So opened it up already because I was nosy. It's the foundation that they also turn into concealer. So I'm probably gonna record a video for you guys showing you how I use both, depending on what I'm going for, whether I'm trying to do full coverage and, um, Basically, be I have full face of makeup. I'm just trying to do a little bit, a little something, something. So this is a soft, focused foundation, medium to full coverage, and I have it in the uh, color filter deep 36. And then I also have the filter effect soft radiance concealer, which is um deep 36 as well, but it's warm. And uh, thinking about my undertones, thinking about. Summertime, maybe I should have gotten it cool. I'm um, not 100% sure, still doing research on makeup, but we're gonna see how it feels in the skin and we'll go from there. But I'm really excited to try these products. I'm really excited to add it to my um, collection of makeup. Let me just take a quick look to see what they looking like up in here. Come on, work with me. Oh, I gotta cut this. Interesting. This is actually taped on. That's pretty cool. 
taped on, so I gotta cut it to open it. Here I am trying to figure out the easiest thing to do, and it's like, look. This is the easiest. Just cut it. Cut it. Cut it. Cut it. Aw, this is like basically a tinier version of the same thing. That's so cool. Okay. Boom. Okay, we're starting with the concealer. It's to a swatch. Okay, this is what the concealer looks like. First of all, um, I think it'll work actually because this is warm. This one's just deep. So let's see. We're gonna have to see the skin tone and see how this works out for us because yeah, and this is the foundation. So we're gonna open up this and we're just gonna do a little swatch. Dark. Do a swatch here. Okay. I'm like, hmm, I'm gonna have to blend that in, see if that even works with my skin. And then this is the concealer. So I have my foundation brush from BH Cosmetics. This is my blending brush. Um, that I usually use on my skin. So I'm gonna try blending out the foundation first. Okay. Really trying not to um, touch the concealer. Okay, you see it, right? Yeah, it shows right there. I can see it. And then now I'm gonna use the other part of the brush to do the concealer. Wow. Not that I need any more makeup on my face, but uh. Okay, this could work. You see that? Huh. Interesting. Interesting, okay. That might actually be better than what I, um, and obviously I have to keep building and building and building, but that might be better than the color that I'm using right now. I actually use the, I don't remember what it's called. But what I use is not uh, foundation. What I use is actually a BB cream or like a CC cream and it has uh, sunscreen in it. So now I'm probably gonna go more over to uh, foundations moving forward. Um, just to kind of see, Morphe is a really good brand. So I'm excited to try it out and add this to my makeup collection, y'all. Yeah. Well, I believe that's all that was newly added to my um, items that I have in the various part of my home for right now. Thank you guys so much for watching. If you like this video, don't forget to give it a thumbs up. Also make sure you subscribe to the channel so you can see all the new videos that I'm posting and I hope to see you guys on the next one. Be blessed, spread love, and stay beautiful inside and out. Bye. Show me a picture. <laughs>